last summer, 27 pounds of leaking TNT was discovered right behind this fence line. As a result, the U.S. Army Corps of Engineers put up the fence and big signs that say, danger, keep out. They have to because the land we're standing on is actually the Tidewater Community College over in Suffolk on the southern side of the Monitor Merrimack Bridge Tunnel. Now, years ago, during World War I and World War II, this was actually the Nansman Ordnance Depot where they refurbished, shipped, and stored munitions used for the fighting overseas. After the fighting was over in both of the world wars, this depot closed down and, it, and the ownership went into private hands, first a, a boys academy and eventually to the state and they built the community college. What they've discovered starting in the late 80s is the military left behind a perilous legacy. There's a lot of munitions buried beneath the soil, TNT buried behind that fence line. It's the only site in Hampton Roads that is actively getting cleaned up by the U.S. Army Corps of Engineers. Back in 1987, a young teenage boy was playing on this plot of, of land right here on the Tidewater Community College campus in Suffolk and discovered some brown stuff. It turned out to be two tons of TNT, which was breaking down its chemical components and becoming very unstable. Now we're right next to the college's soccer fields. The U.S. Army Corps of Engineers came in after this discovery was made, discovered that it was actually TNT breaking down, and started cleaning up. It took nine years to clean up this site. Back through the woods, behind signs that say no, no trespassing environmental cleanup, there are several old warehouses, old buildings that were used when the the depot was in operation, and there are signs that there are people still trespassing back there despite the hazards. As a result of the, the workers at the former depot leaving behind this, this TNT, some of the TNT has seeped down into the groundwater. The U.S. Army Corps of Engineers is monitoring it, and what they're, what they're noticing is that it's breaking down into DNT, which is a carcinogen and is still dangerous, but, but it is breaking down. One of the concerns they have is that it is moving towards the river. Hundreds of unexploded munitions have been found in the land right here behind me. Mortar rounds, artillery shells, a bomb. Work to clean up this piece of land started in 2001 and it's still not complete. What it is, it's referred to the old burn pit and it's where when the depot was in operation, they would, they would try and discard some of their, their old weaponry, old fuses, things like this that they were using in their munitions. They burned it and when they left, everything that was in the burn pit remained beneath the soil.